This is the first phase of creating this cool dormer roof with the little peak on there and the eyebrow effect on there was kind of neat. So we're going to look over here. We've got stage kind of set. Nothing really tricky going on. A couple of walls that are sitting on the second floor. There's no joining or anything going on here if you go to a floor plan. So those are just plunked on the second floor. So I'm going to create the eyebrow roof first here. So I'm going to go to the south view, click on there, and there I have a reference plane in there. So I'm going to start by doing a roof by extrusion instead of by footprint we usually do. And I'm going to say pick a plane and hit OK and I'm going to pick this front face. Boom. That sets the work plane up at level two here. That's OK. We can put it up as high as we want. Now you can use all these sketch shapes and different arc shapes. You should experiment with that. But I'm going to use this arc and come across and do something like that. And then I'm going to stay in the arc tool. I can change and then go over here and create that. So that's a little tangent point. Hit escape on the keyboard and escape again. Grab this little grip and bring it back. Hit escape again. Click on here. Hit my mirror tool, mirror that about there, hit escape again. Now from here I can go change my roof type to whatever I want. I can switch to a 3D view, there it is there. It's going to extrude out the front. I can change this if I want to be, you know, minus 10 feet if I want because I know it's going to go in the other direction and hit OK. And there it is there. If it goes in the wrong direction, that's okay because you can pull these. And all I want to do is pull this through and form that seam line that's right there. You see that seam line? I want to get that and I'm going to use that. So for now, what I can do is use my join tool up in here. And you can create shortcut keys for all these. And I'm going to say join. And I'm going to say join the main roof with this guy. Boom, and that's going to form a hard line between those two points. While I'm in here, I can join this with this, but the sidewalls, I'm ultimately going to change the profile of that anyway, so I don't have to worry about that. I'm going to use a edit profile on that. Escape, escape. So that's kind of just our first phase of doing that. I can take this wall here and say, attach the top up to here, kind of make it look nice. So there's the first part of our nice little dormer project. 